uh, it's very simple to crop a picture that you have uh, within Word. Uh, notice when I click on a picture, the Format tab is highlighted automatically. If I click on that, uh, you can see the uh, uh, crop button is right here. And uh, a real benefit to the latest version of Word is I can uh, crop my picture. Watching the size right here, you can see it's 4.4, 4.17. Um, I can uh, adjust that. Let's say I want to make a square uh, until I get those two numbers until they're uh, uh, pretty much identical. You know, like I said, I'm making a square. Uh, so I'm within two hundredths of an inch. Uh, very close. Good enough. But th here's the, the nice thing. I can now uh, move the, this picture around within that crop box. That's really handy, something you couldn't do in the last version of Word. Now when I'm finished, I click the crop box again, and you can see I have a square. Now let's say that I wanted to make this bigger or smaller. Anytime I resize a photo, I want to make sure that I keep uh, the aspect ratio, the height to the width ratio. I want to keep the resize version the same as the original. So if I have a small picture, in this case, it should still be a square. Or if I have a really big picture, same deal. Let me make this a little smaller so you can see it. It's uh, still a square. Now, the way that I did that was uh, simply dragging the corner to resize the picture. Now, if I grab an edge and resize, typically Word does not keep the aspect ratio consistent. So I end up with this stretched picture. I'm going to undo this. Or if I grab uh, this edge, same deal. Now you could, if you're really good, you could drag the edges back and forth to kind of get it to where you think it looks all right. But notice here, I have uh, 6.03, 6.52. Those were those were within uh, two hundredths uh, of an inch. Now they're within half an inch. That's a big difference. The picture's no longer uh, the right aspect ratio. Uh, so it's always best, if you're going to resize by dragging, to drag a corner, not an edge. Now, there's another option. If I right-click on the picture and go to uh, Size and Position, uh, a couple of things. Notice there's a box right here that says Lock the Aspect Ratio. That is what makes dragging the corner uh, work. As long as this little box is checked when I drag the corner, it won't let me make it wider than it is tall. Notice also there's a couple percentages here. It says the scale. It says at this moment 43 percent of the height and 43 percent of the width. Those two numbers should be identical if the aspect ratio is consistent. In other words, if I haven't stretched it uh, sideways or up and down. Now if I wanted to, I could right here type in the new size that I want. Here I typed in two inches. You can see it's not perfectly square. I'm, I'm within one hundredth of an inch. But notice this is 19% and 19%. Now when I click on this, notice my uh, ruler here on the top of the page. I have uh, a two inch wide picture, a two inch tall picture. I have a square picture. And I did that by going to the size and, and position and manually do it. Just another way that you could resize if you uh, we're very particular about getting it to uh, a certain size and didn't want to do that by dragging it.